it's cold, dude. It is. Excuse until ice. 34. It is cold. And we're gonna go try to go on the kayak. So let's see how that goes. But the good news is also that it's cold because that means trout are moving. So I'm gonna load up the kayak. Uh, I should have everything and load up the kayak and I should just need to stop to get a bait Once I get bait, we should be ready to go up there. So it's 644 Well Time changed yesterday. So 644 is something around like 744 normally Or I'm not sure how this works, but it's seven. It's 644 right now and we're gonna go out there So we got to get out there and get on the water and it's cold. So let's see what happens catching with Oscar but work my way this way try my luck over here towards that's where we usually fish right there off from shore that's where we're usually at so we'll fish this area a little bit if nothing happens we'll move back behind us and uh something was blowing here or like coming up right here not too long ago I was like casting my rods out so I have this one set up right here, the other one more towards the bank, so let's see how it goes We're right here in this area. That guy just caught one right there, and that's where we usually, usually at when we from shore, so we'll try here for a bit, if not, we'll start making our way behind us, and I'll see what happens. It's a little bit further from where we were, but towards, we were a little bit that way, and facing that way, we moved towards facing the sun now probably not good for video but you know we're over here Let me go a little further back now Let's see what kind of action's going down over here so we'll give it a little bit if not we'll try to try to fix something up see if we can start finding some fish that one guy is the only one I've seen catch a fish so far this morning so it looks like it's being a little, looks like the bite isn't really on, so we'll keep working on it, see what happens. Oh, it's a little dude. It's a little dude. But, it's, oh, it's off. Okay, sweet. I didn't have to deal with that. little guy though he ate that on the actually on the first cast of the panther martin i believe it is yeah golden panther martin one of my old old time favorite baits that i used to use for literally pretty much everything i'd go bass fishing i'd use it when i was little so literally anything any kind of if I would go trout fishing, I'd use it. Bass fishing, I'd use it. it just what I used for pretty much everything. So, first cast. Let's see what we can do on. Sort of. So we can get down on the second cast. There's some big fish jumping, and there's also little fish jumping. So I think we got a mix of everything. Oh, that thing just hit it so hard, and oh, I'm so disappointed that one came off. That was a good fish. Okay, there we go. 
see something good on this one. I think lures might be the way to go. Whew. Oh, okay, right there. Get this untangled from up here. I definitely think lures is going to be the way to go. I think it's very big, but this, yeah, it's not very big, but this is, actually it's decent, it's alright, this is what's going to be, oh, that's the paddle, in the water, first fish, here we go, nice, Oh, it came unhooked too for us. That makes it a lot easier. Look at that. Oof, that is our first fish. Mom's wet now, not really. It's just wet. Okay. Try this one. Show you guys the fish. I just, I just lost a lure, so I put this one on in first cast. That's the first cast with this lure, and this thing just destroyed it. It's the second fish of the day, boys. Oh, that's a good one too. Come on, buddy. Oh, he's in. He's in. Yes. Second fish. We have did it. Second fish. Let me. Back, back, and yes, the little thing 
is part of it. It's kind of loopy. Yeah, let's see if we can get another one. Yep. Shoot. We still got bait. Yeah, we have bait. Okay. Okay. Oh. Eat it. Eat it. There you go. Third one of the day. Not not the biggest, but not bad. That works. Got number three. Oh, sweet. In the net. Oh, he's out of the net. Okay, let's not lose it. And he's back in. Correction. He's through the net. I don't know how that worked. Unless there's a hole in my net. There's a hole in my net. That makes more sense. Okay. Let me see what I can do here. Because there's apparently a hole in my net. I threw the bobber rack out and oh, oh my net. I threw the bobber rack out and oh, that's on the wrong side. Threw the bobber rack out and threw this guy and as oh, oh he's in. He is in and we got another one. We have another one. Do we? Oh, I thought we did. But oh shoot, he got me wet. Put that down for a second. Okay. That's number three. Uh, that's weird because I have everything set up to land them on this side. But yeah, that's number three. Yeah. We were getting hits on the back of the wall, which was like, I thought 
big one just jumped right there and uh, right through the bobber. So I'll throw the bobber right there and check it out. balance out right here and hopefully not get messed around by the wind. Cast you. Oh, that was actually a really good cast. That actually was pretty good compared to how I thought it was going to turn out. And we're going to try to balance out here without getting cast too far off the court. Oh! Come on, one more time, one more time, one more time, one more time. Oh, shoot, we missed it. That just to give you how strong it went, how, an idea how strong the wind is, we're already way off from where I was. Okay, I'm gonna try to go on that side so it takes us longer to drift over here and gives it a longer chance for that fish to bite because there are some big ones right up in there. Yes, there's little ones mixed in, but just let go of the little ones, throw it back in because I know there's some good sized ones in there. So if we can hang out on maybe on this side and drift slowly under that tree i think that tree is going to be key right now i think it is on our best interest to hang out to have our bobber hang out under that tree even the lure but i think it's going to get a little complicated trying to balance the wind and two rods so we're going to put you back up it wouldn't be too bad if it wasn't windy I wouldn't have to use the paddle as much. I can just keep it on my lap and or put it off to the side. But when it starts to get windy, I gotta use the paddle a lot more. And having two rods out is not that easy. Oh, there you go. Get some on. Come on. Come on, take it. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. There we go. I don't think this one's too big. It's it's not bad. No, it's a little dude. Just a little guy. Oh that was a Wow. This is a come on, buddy. Come on. Okay. This we're doing the it's not a bad fish though. Either way, like for this being the For this being the little, the smallest one of the day, that's not a bad fish. I think he might make it on the stringer. He's like, oop. Okay, I guess no. <sighs> Let me clean my face off because I am all kinds of wet from these last few fish. So get myself back set up, move spots, and I think we got one on. Get this one away. I've been seeing lots of fish jump over here, and. Yep. Not a bad fish. Come on, buddy. Oh, he's not done. Oh my goodness. Come on. He's in.
There we go. Oh, this guy kind of swallowed it. guy go. Oh, oh, sweet, it came out. I'm so glad that one came off. I'm so glad that one came off. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm going to be mad if I just lost both of them. Nope. This one's still on. Oh, it came off. I just lost two fish at the same time. I caught them at the same time, and I lost them at the same time. Dang it. One popped off the lure. The other one popped off the... The worm. Right as I I started to see this one bounce, the one off the lure just got the lure got smacked. I need one more fish though. Let's see if the lure will take it on this one. Oh my god! I'm taking this one out. There's some big fish following. My lure, I gotta get in a better position and cast it back out and hope we can get it. That was a big fish. I'll just try to stay here and cast back out that way. That was a good fish that followed it in. Some good fish up in here. See if that one will hit it. These are some huge freaking trout right up in here. got hooked up on we got a double and then we lost the double at the same time dang it I had to get myself set up Pretty nice, calm morning, so time to go get some food and 